Okie dokie guys, hi, welcome back to Let's Play Minish Cap, I'm Kralix, here to guide you through this little underground labyrinth on a lily pad. I feel like a frog. So anyway, um, I'm hoping that uh, if I don't dork around like I did in the last episode, you know, getting lost and everything, hoping that if I don't dork around like I did in the last episode, I will have time to fight the boss of the dungeon, because... This is, like, basically the last part of the dungeon, so... Oh, dang it. Stupid bug. Die. So, yeah, this is the last part of the dungeon. Um, and, uh, this place that we're going... There was another way that we could go before, but it just led to a locked door, so we have to go this way first. Because remember that other little red chest that we, um, opened up down here? The, in the room where we got the compass. Well, now that we've got the lily pad and we can float on water, we can get to that. And what does it hold? Is it candy? No, it's a small key. Now we can go unlock that door. So yeah, um... <laughs> the, the boss of this dungeon is pretty easy. I mean, it's the first dungeon. You know, the first boss should be fairly easy. But, uh, you know, I don't want to take any chances and run out of time in the middle of the boss battle. Because... That would just suck. That would just suck so hard. So yeah, we'll go this way now. Watch out for the slugs falling from the ceiling. Open the door, and through here. Alright, fairly self-explanatory for this room. Just use the mushrooms to leap yourself across and gust jar when needed. So anyway, um, remember how I said last time I was going to go see Despicable Me with my friends? Well, I did, and, uh, I really liked it. I, I really liked that movie. It's a fairly, you know, done plot device, you know, cold-hearted guy gets his heart softened. It's it's fairly common, but they did a pretty good, pretty good job of it. But the main part of it, you know, the minions, they just stole the show. The minions stole the entire show. They are what made the movie awesome, the minions. I actually want a minion now. I think it would be cool to have a minion of my own. Oh, dang it. Come on. Do it the right way this time, Kralix. There you go. So anyway, if you're low on hearts, um, you can break these pots. They've all got hearts in them. Anyway, let's go to the boss. Oh yeah, I'll have plenty of time. What's this? It's one of those green choo-choos. What the heck is it doing? Oh my gosh. It's melting. It disappeared. Where is it? Uh-oh. Closed door behind us. What the? Oh no. Oh no. Oh noes. Oh noes. It's... Uh... It's Choo Choo Zilla! Yeah. Just suck the stuff out from the bottom of him. And uh, avoid it when he jumps on you. And eventually he'll overbalance, and you just have to dodge him until he falls over. When he falls over, go ape crap with your sword! And when he does this, he'll jump around at you for a while. So. So yeah, it's not very hard. This guy's really easy to dodge. Like, a little harder when he gets faster, but... Come on. This guy's gonna be dead so quickly. That earth element's in the bag. Okay, yeah. Sorry, sorry if I'm not talking very much during this battle. I, I get focused and unresponsive. And he's dead already. That was way too easy. Easiest heart container in the game. Well, except for one, but... Here we go! Earth element! It's purple. Look at Link, he's so triumphant. You got the earth element. The power of the earth is the source of all living things. The earth element is the embodiment of that power. Cool beans. And here's our heart container. Now we have five hearts, 
And as you notice, we didn't lose even a piece of one heart. This will teleport you back to the entrance. Just like normal. See? And now Isla's, Isla's like, Yay, we have the Earth Element, let's go tell the Elder. Okay, well, we'll do that. We'll go this way, since there's not much else. Not really too much else we can do. Hey, hi, Fistari. You retrieved the Earth Element from the Fiend-infested sh shrine? Gaspeth! Oh, wait, incredible. Humans are amazing creatures. Yes, we are! Uh, <laughs> don't want to get a big head here. So we'll go talk to the Elder. He'll natter on about stuff. Hi! Oh, hi. So, you have found the Earth Element. You are blessed with much courage and strength for one so young. If your convention holds strong, head to Mount Crenel. There you will find a man mi named Milari. That's another Minish. Yeah. Among all of the Minish, there is no one more able to repair your sword. If you ask him, I am certain he will reforge your broken Picori blade. I shall send word to him in advance. Travel safely. You are brave, but there are many eagles now. Eagles? Evils now in this world. And he walks very slowly over to open a curtain. Open a door. Leave through this door here. It'll take you out of the forest quickly. Oh, good. Great Elder, we are in your debt. Yeah, sure. We shall head for Mount Cornell at once. Oh, but what if I wanted to do other stuff? Well, too bad, Isla. We're, we are going to do other stuff first. Because, yeah, there, there's several things that come up. Now, occasionally you'll find these little minish houses. Hello. Green clothes and a mystical hat? Question mark, exclamation point, question mark. Sir, would you would you be, by chance, be Link, the one who found the Earth Element? Surely you are. I have heard so many tales by you. I just barely got the Earth Element like four minutes, no, two minutes ago. I am Belar, the researcher of antiquities. I am also a little bit of an inventor. You know, you won't be able to get back, in town, back to town due to all the debris. Here, I have something that might come in handy. You get the bombs. Bombs? It has ten bombs in it. How generous. Now you can blow up stuff. Yay. We can go Hiroshima on their butts. I'm just being ridiculous this morning. Yeah. When you're in image form, you just come to one of these, press R, and it'll get you back to normal size. Oh, look. What's this? Holder of the sacred powers, we grant you the power of the wind. Huh? Hmm? Whoa, it blew up. Hey kid, look at where that stone marker used to be. There's some strange symbol on the ground. Yes, of course. Why, right? this must be... Well, I haven't the fog yet, to be honest. Hmm. Well, Isla's out of his depth, and... Yeah, I know what these are for, but I'm not going to tell you! Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> but yeah, they they come in handy later in the game. They, they really do. They're very handy. Yeah, let's try this way first. See what's up this way. I'm just a bunch of minish stuff. Okay! Time to use our bombs! Bombs. Oops. <laughs> Messed up with my items there. Oopsie. Explode! Yay. And we exit the Minish Woods back to the Eastern Hills. And, you know, since uh, we don't have to go back to Hyrule Town just yet, I'm going to explore a bit. So as I recall, there's something over here. If I don't drop myself into a hole first. <laughs> Sweet to his face turns red. Oh look! More bomb stuff. Bombs. I need to stop doing that. <laughs> and hey, a minish portal here and a minish house there. Let's go check them out. Ta-da! Yeah, you can skip the animation once you've already done it. Hello! Oh hi. Hey, look at this kinstone piece. Have you ever seen one like this? What? You don't know what a kinstone piece is? Well, tell you what, why don't you come back and see me when you get one, okay? Oh yeah, okay, so yeah. Um, kinstones, we'll be getting... You'll be getting more information about those a little... Pretty soon, anyway. Um, so, they're, they're very... The kinstones allow you to unlock a bunch of different stuff. So, what's in here? Ooh, a treasure chest. And a bunch of keys, I hate keys. Especially fire keys, like an offering of time. I hate fire keys. They kept burning up my shield. I hated it. Get in the jar! Thank you. Okay. 20 mysterious shells! Okay. Ooh, scary music. Okay. Uh, nothing much over this way. So we'll go this way. Avoid that thing. 
suck in the pea hat. Because we can. Hey, I thought I sucked you. No, not that way, Link. Come here, pea hat. I want to suck you up and destroy you. Uh -huh. Okay, well, looks like I am out of time for this episode. Man, it goes by so quickly. So, until next time. Oh, excuse me, I yawned. Um, until next time, this is Kralix doing a Let's Play of Legend of Zelda Minish Cap. Adios.